Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, how much depending on your location, please join in the struggle to liberate our people from the contraption, like and share videos, news updates. Gunmen attack governorship candidate in Rivers, kill two of his aides. Yes, gunmen dressed in military uniform on Monday morning attacked the Rivers State governorship candidate of the National Rescue Movement in the 2023 charade conducted by the biased umpire dependent biased umpire yes Subo Mabo Jack Rich was attacked in his residence at the wee hours of Monday the 8th day of April 2024 yes in Usoku Degama local government area of River State now it was gathered that two of his aides found when his residence was raided around 3 a.m. on Monday were shot dead by these assailants. Yes, and their remains were taken along with their principal, Jack Rich. Yes, that is what is happening in River State now. In River State, that's what's happening. Degema, Degema local government. That's what is happening. Degema local government. Gunmen dressed in military uniform attacks the residents of the former governorship candidates in River State. They wakes him away, abduction. They abducted him. They killed two of his, you know, aides. That is it. In River State, they said he's a former, you know, former militant leader they called him a query papa a query papa a former militant leader they said he embraced he embraced amnesty during the tenure of uh, late president umar musayadwa you see it so it has been confirmed the assailant came attacked the residence of this jack rich in the wee hours of Monday, abducted him, killed two of his aides. They cutted the bodies of this uh, aides alongside their principal, Jack Rich. So that is what is happening. Yes. So one of the or the media aide to this uh, to this uh, Jack Rich, so Boybo, so Kari, confirmed the killing. In his words, quote, yes, it is true, he was abducted this morning. Two persons were killed and their bodies were cutted away along with him. We are still following up on the incident to get more details. We don't know exactly who is behind it. But as the details unfold, we will let the public know about it. End of quote. Yes, this is what happened. But a source who spoke on the condition of anonymity said that it was the military that abducted this person, this governorship candidate, Jack Ridge. It was the military that carried out the attack on his in his residence. So the military, the army. Yes, yes. So the police confirmed it. The army attacked the residence of this former governorship candidate. Yes, the army. They killed these two eggs. So they carried out the attack. You have seen what is happening. Yes. Look at the statement of the spokesperson of the River State Police Command, Grace Iringe Koko. She confirmed the, 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 the incident. Yes. And she said that it was not a case of kidnap, but that Jack Rich is with security personnel. Yes. In her words, quote, it's not a kidnapping. He is with some security personnel. That is all I can say for now. End of quote. Don't see him. Police confirm say, na army, na do that thing for Jack Rich House, killing two of his assistants. You have seen what is happening in the entire, you know, Niger Delta since the Okwama killings. The army has been raiding communities there, provoking 
the the natives, the people. In Okuama, the villagers, they have fled to the bush, to the forest. They have been sleeping there almost three weeks now. Yes, nobody is saying anything. People are keeping quiet. You've seen it. So it seems that these people, nobody is speaking again. They are saying to Kuba, where is he? Look at what's happening. It's town, it's communities. Yes. So that is what is happening. The army carried out the attack in that location. They gave out. They killed two persons. And now the deputy director of the army public relations in that division, they said his name is Colonel Jonah Danjuma, has not been picking his calls. They have been calling him to ascertain what actually happened. But he refused to pick us, his calls. But the police has confirmed it. So what else are you calling him for? Police said it is not act of kidnapping. The army carried out the attack. You see him? Even police, army don't chance police. Army don't chance them for internal security, for the, for the contraption. As long as the contraption is concerned, Police know they're in charge of internal security. Now, I mean, I mean, they're in charge now. I mean, it's in charge. They're everywhere. And them there in charge. They are doing investigation. They are doing arrest. What remains now is to prosecute. Very soon, they'll start prosecution in the court of law to prosecute offenders. Yes. So there's nothing remains for the contraption. It's finished. It's finished. We are telling them they don't believe. But it's obvious now. It's crystal clear. Yes, that they are in a first state. People have to realize this. It's a bitter truth that you must accept if you're a realist. That is a first state that you are living in a failed in an entity. The army is in charge of internal security. They don't chase police away. And them they're in charge now. They arrest anyhow. They attack people, send arrest them, that, which kind of arrest? They go to people's houses, they attack them. They invade communities, they attack individuals. They invade, you know, compound, people's houses, family houses. You've seen it. So, I may carry this attack to two persons. This is, you know, it's too bad. Too bad. Nobody is saying anything. People are keeping quiet. Wow. What a country. What a country. So, now so this Mutego. Yes. Nothing. Just military invasion. Attack. They say gunmen. Which gunmen? From the report we received, they said they came with branded vehicle. Even with the armored personnel carrier APC. 